Hey guys, Drew here again for Z Code System, and this week we're taking another look at NFL picks. And we've got NFL Week 11 coming up, and as you can see there, some divisional matchups are coming up this weekend, and they're going to have direct effects on the NFL playoff picture. Now, guys, you can go over to Z Code System and get all of the great picks we have there for NFL, NBA, and any of the other sports that you follow, NHL, Premier League Soccer, and once baseball kicks, uh, once baseball starts back up again in the new year, you'll have all of that there and all the great systems that we have and the VIP wall, of course. So, guys, let's take a look at NFL Week 11. I'm going to share two games with you, two picks. You can go over and check out a third at the blog and uh, get more information there. And the one you can check out on the blog is the Buffalo Bills and the Miami Dolphins. But we're going to be talking about two different games, one in the NFC, one in the AFC, and you can get those now. So let's start out with an NFC South showdown between the Atlanta Falcons and the Carolina Panthers. Now, Neither team playing great this season. The Falcons, as you can see, they are dead up. They did pick up a big win last weekend against the New Orleans Saints, which was a big of a, a bit of a shock uh, around the NFL. The Falcons suddenly showed up and played, but perhaps that win was a little bit down to the Saints playing poorly uh, in uh, New Orleans last week, and that was a uh, a big win there. And we can check out the score from that, and that was a twenty-six to nine win. So. A big shock there as the Falcons, as you can see, uh, lost five straight games previously uh, in the NFC or in the NFL, that is. Carolina Panthers, they're average right now. They did lose last week in a bit of up and down right now. They did lose to the Packers. Packers are a very good team. And uh, Aaron Rodgers right now, my MVP pick uh, in the NFL. And you can see those two losses came against very difficult teams, Green Bay and San Francisco. So I'm thinking... In my mind, and as you can see with Zoo Code System prediction there, Carolina are going to come back this week and get a big win over an NFC South rival. Now, Carolina is on the outside looking in of the playoffs, and this will help them, hopefully for them, their sake, build towards the postseason. Big news this week in Carolina is the potential trade of quarterback Cam Newton. He's out injured right now. Kyle Allen uh, is playing. He had over 300 yards and a touchdown last week in that loss to the Packers. But, uh, excuse me, but Newton uh, is looking like he is headed for the exit there in Carolina. And according to reports uh, from the Bleacher Report, he is going to welcome a trade possibly to the Chicago Bears. Uh, Carolina owing him $19 million next season. They want to get that off the wage bill. And Kyle Allen, I guess, proving that he is the future there uh, over the course of the season with Newton injured. So, as you can see there, there's our score pick. We've got Carolina 41, Atlanta 24. I'm going with Carolina on this game. I think that they're going to rebound after that loss. And I think the Falcons' win in New Orleans last week was a bit of a, um, not only a surprise and a shock, but just a bit of a, a, an anomaly. And uh, we're going to get back to what we have seen from this whole season for the Falcons. So I'm going Panthers on this one. All right, let's take a look at one more game, and we're going to go over to the AFC West for this, a Monday night showdown between the L.A. Chargers, the Chargers, who no one in L.A. wants, and the Kansas City Chiefs. And as you can see here, we've got that. Kansas City is ice cold, according to Z-Code system at the moment, up and down, as you can see from those wins and losses. Kansas City struggling uh, this season to get those wins. The defense has been very, very poor. Look at that, giving up 35 points to the Titans, 23 to the Vikings, 31 to the Packers. Uh, they did hold the Broncos to six, but who can't do that? But the Chiefs defense is not playing very well right now. Patrick Mahomes really carrying this team last weekend. He had over 400 yards passing and three touchdowns. How did the Chiefs not win against the Titans when that happens? Of course, it's because of bad defense. So Chiefs going into L.A. right now to take on the Chargers, who lost last weekend as well. They lost to the Oakland Raiders 26-24 in a very close game in Oakland. After that, they did pick up that big win over the Packers and a big win over the Bears. The Chargers, what can we say? They're up and down as well. Uh, their home field advantage is nullified this season uh, and last season at uh, Dignity Health Stadium. Fans of opposing teams are coming out and uh, outnumbering those Charger fans who are in L.A. And I think that atmosphere is going to 
help the Chiefs this weekend and uh, give them or help them to a win. I think Mahomes is going to have a, a big, big game uh, there. And as you can see, we're going to look here at the Chargers, 16th overall in offense, and uh, they do are they are sixth overall in defense. But look at that, the Chiefs third in offense, and that is mostly down to Patrick Mahomes, who has been fantastic. And had he not been injured for a few weeks, I think he would definitely be our MVP this season. I mean, he still could be, but right now I do like Aaron Rodgers for that award. But I do love Patrick Mahomes and what he can do under center. So, guys, I'm going with the Chiefs here. Just a, a quick look here. We can take a look at the head-to-head -head before we go. And uh, you can see that the away team has actually won the last two games between these teams. They've not played yet this year. Now, the Chiefs are the away team, and I'm picking them to win and to stay on track there in the AFC West to make the playoffs. Right now, they are a wild card in the playoffs. Chargers chasing the playoffs. Will they get in? I don't think so. And I think the Chiefs will beat them this weekend. So, guys, those are my picks, and those are all up at Z Code System. You can check out the VIP wall and get all this great information, uh, the point spread forecast, the totals, and all the different tools that we use at Z Code System. You can go there and check that out. Don't forget, go over to the blog, check out our blogs there, and you can read up about the Buffalo Bills and Miami Dolphins, which is going on in the AFC East. Big game for the Bills as they try to hold on to a playoff place after losing last weekend to the Cleveland Browns. So, guys, good luck this week with your profits. Be sure you're commenting on all of our videos. Let us know how you're doing and maybe some of the games that you are predicting and you're picking on. So, guys, good luck, good luck, and good luck this week with all your NFL Week 11 bets. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.